Kevin. Hey. So we're, we're pre-gaming. We're pre-gaming for the Facebook Live. We're, oh, this is on time. But I got some music for us. Oh, I can't. I, I'm going to turn my sound. I can't hear it. Oh. Yeah. Come classic. on. Got to get Europe in here. For Europe, you know, you think about this as their main song, the final countdown. I guess it's good. They're probably all getting paid in royalties. It's, Hello, it's kind of like um, the Verve with Bittersweet Symphony. The best part yes. of the song is when they don't sing. That's right. <laughs> <It's> the... <laughs> well, folks, it is the final countdown as the band Europe oh. is singing to us. I'm Mike Lyon, and this is Kevin Oakley with Do You good Convert. Afternoon. You can unsubscribe at any time from this uh, Facebook <laughs> Live by just clicking X. Uh, we're excited to talk with you because it is the final countdown for the online sales and marketing pulse. Kevin, I'm terrible at this. I've not been watching the numbers because we have other people watching the numbers. I don't know where we're at now. What are what is no, our we are total red past two fifty, and I think we're gonna exceed three hundred. Which I I don't know how. I didn't know there were three hundred people in marketing and online sales, kind of total. So I'm not. <laughs> I, we, what I, I what are. is interesting is the VIP Pulse groups. We did surveys of those folks, so we know more about who they are. Um, we knew a lot of them. A lot of regulars to, to our events are in there, but um, I think the ratio right now is about 50 to 60%, man, about 50% marketers, about 40% online sales and 10% leadership, which wow. if I would say there's a, there's a group that everyone needs to nudge, uh, especially if you're getting to close to that group discount volume number is to get a leader on, even if they're only on for portions of this call, because well, the way I would set it up, would just be to say, hey, Mr. or Mrs. Leader, what what's next year going to be like? What should we plan for? And how yeah, should we good. how should we react to that and watch them go? I, I don't know which way it's going to go. Yeah. Well, I love that. You know, we want to talk about this. if you're joining us. Welcome. Tell us where you're tuning in from. And if you're coming to the pulse, if you're coming, smash a some kind of emoji. We'll take GIFs will take comments. So we want to know if you're watching live with us today, if you are coming to the Pulse and how many people from your organization are coming. That's always great. And just like Kevin said, I mean, we're starting to see some, a little bit of FOMO because the registrations, like the weirdest thing about this is that we get like four or five people every single day. And you're like, why didn't, what, what, why are they, what are they waiting for? What are they seeing? And we figured it out. If you don't have to book travel and a flight, you can book anytime you want, you want, except now. So we are on with you Facebook Live today for a reason. We want you to register today because, Kevin, tell them what we're doing and what we're organizing for the Pulse groups because I think that's something everybody needs to understand. We don't want them to miss this opportunity to engage before the actual event. Yeah, I was talking to um, my dad actually last night and I said, I have to do some wedding planning this week. And he's like, what are you talking about? And it's a little bit like when you're at a wedding and you're trying to figure out who's the best people to sit at everyone's table. And so the VIP pulse groups are done. Yeah. We've surveyed those people and we've learned more, but even as they come in, we're going to do our best for as long as we can. But um, like Mike said, this is ramping up where originally it was a couple a day, then five a day. I think yesterday we had around 16 people register. So there will become certainly a point where we're just going to have to start putting people in conversational groups, but it might not be the same balance of all mostly online salespeople, mostly marketers, mostly leaders, et cetera. We really want you to be able to find the best fit. So this relationship can hopefully last beyond the pulse as a type of uh, independent small group that you can lean on and, and work with uh, for the rest of your career potentially. But uh, we are gonna, everyone will be in, in a group and we just won't be able to curate them as well as we proceed from this point, so. I love it. Thank you for that clarification. Diane, yeah. thank you for your comment. Randy, thank you for your comment. We're excited to see you guys there too. Again, if you're coming, uh, let us know that you're coming. So a couple of things, Kevin, I the poll groups are important. You wanna be in the, or the wedding tables. That's another good way to put it. <laughs> be at the right wedding table, number four, yeah. close to the front and the good music. The second thing is, um, you know, I had someone text me and say, hey, uh, do you think this is a, a good thing for me to come to? And I'm, I'm going to leave anonymous because I was like, yes, duh, it's a good thing. <laughs> but I didn't say that. I said, absolutely. Um, anybody who's attached to the online sales program or the, or the mar online marketing for your company, anybody who's connected to that and makes decisions around that should be here. 
it's called the pulse for a reason. We're going to give you the latest and greatest. We're going to talk about all this stuff. We're going to connect you with other people. So yes, if this is important to you and your business and your career, which, uh, the uh, spoiler alert, it's every yes. builder <laughs> during, especially with COVID, um, you, this is important to you. So we encourage everybody to attend, um, how you attend is up to you. Now, Kevin, you've talked about this a couple different times. We don't care if you have 50 people in a room and you're streaming this, do we? Right. No, you want one ticket and you got 50 people, 10 people in a room. The only thing to clarify, yeah. and just to make sure everyone understands is that then is your discussion group. You're right. not going to be in a separate discussion group with other groups of 10 people. That just isn't going to work out. So when we have breakout times and any pre-meeting calls or things that, that, that we give you an opportunity to get interactive with, you'll get interactive with the people around you in, yeah. in your physical space. Yeah. So again, we are setting this up. Now, one of the things I was reading the other day on the website, as I read our own website about this was <laughs> it's just not a bunch of, it's not a bunch of zoom calls. Uh, yep. it is on zoom. Let's clarify one thing. It is on zoom because that technology, what we have found through all of our research, could we go out and buy a $15,000 virtual event platform that might break? Yes. Or why don't we just use zoom, which everybody listening to this right now, if you know, zoom smash, I got it. I've been on 72 <laughs> zooms. We want to know how many zoom meetings you've been on in the past week. Ooh, that's a good question for those watching live. How many oh, Zoom wow. meetings have you been on in the past week? I think over I've been over sixty. <laughs> would be my guess. <laughs> Too many. Um, so it's going to be on the the enhanced Zoom with um, breakouts and all those fun things. And Kevin, tell them what we're using for our commenting and group uh, yeah. group stuff to continue. So talk about so, that a little bit. Yeah, and, and just a clarification on the Zoom. So there will be a continuous stream for all yes. sessions. So there's Thank not going to be any. How do I get the link to this? I'm lost. I don't. I can't get in. Um, it'll be the same same stream the entire time as we switch from sessions to session to session That's because right. we are using a professional uh, studio environment and we'll have all that stuff. So it'll be super easy. But on your breakouts, you'll be using Slack. Which if you don't know what Slack is, it is a private instant messaging tool. And the beauty of that is uh, you'll be able to talk to those in your group about what you're watching. Uh, you'll also be able to chat in Zoom in the group chat as well uh, and get interactive with the different speakers. But if you just want to ask a question amongst your group, you can do that in your group is where you will get your private and all your breakouts will be in the same room again. So you'll have one Zoom room for your, all of your breakouts with, with those in your group. And then you'll have one for the for the primary stream. And again, the beauty of Slack is if something hits you at seven o'clock at night and you're like, man, that thing that Mike Lyon said was so profound that I need to, I just, I, I have to, I have to tell everyone else my thoughts about it. You can do that at seven o'clock at night and, and each person gets to determine on their own notifications. Do you want your phone to buzz when that happens? Or do you want to yeah. just check on it like another social network stream? But it keeps it all in a nice, tidy little place that's searchable, where you can do direct messages to people in your group. It's just, it's a fantastic way to, to make it feel like uh, a, a virtual event where you have connection with other people. And it Absolutely. doesn't require a camera either. Yep, which that's some, great. Some people... It Still get nervous about the camera. Yeah, no, we don't have to away. force you. We don't have to force you to turn on a camera. You can do that in Zoom. You can you can turn it on. Yeah. You can turn it off. It's up to yeah. you. Here's the here's the thing that I'm getting so excited about. Ke well, first of all, Kevin, uh, fact check me live. Mm -hmm. How stressed out on a scale of one to ten do I usually get before the online sales and marketing summit? Let's just go with a solid thirteen. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, thirteen. <laughs> Super lucky. I am, I am, what do you think I am now? Like you're before this. Oh, you're a, you're a four, maybe a five. Maybe yeah. a five, partially because we got Thais and the team running everything in the background. But other, the other side of this too is everybody is so excited for this event. Even our speakers, like our speakers are like just happy to be sharing a message with you to be streaming in. I've never seen people so excited. I've talked to Scott Stratton twice now, which I feel is lucky that I get to do that. And he's like, oh man, we're going to bring it. It's going to be, this is going to be awesome. And he was on Kevin's podcast and he said, this was one of the best podcasts that he's ever been on with Kevin. So if he's blowing smoke, he's doing a phenomenal job, but he is truly excited to talk with everybody 
in the home building industry. And he's got a lot of experience all the, the logistical estate. stuff. Yeah, because we're we're keeping it simple with the stream, even with a professional studio environment. We've got the Slack groups, but we don't have to worry. And most of the stress, let's be honest with everyone, is all about no, oh, those chairs in the back are a little too far away, or can everyone <laughs> see? Like everyone has the best view. Everyone has hopefully their favorite drink. Everyone has their dietary needs met at lunch, whatever That's unique right. way that they need that met. So there's a lot of, from a hosting standpoint, there's a lot of things that we don't have to be as concerned about, which lets us focus on the content that That's we're right. providing. Yes. Hey, speaking of uh, things to focus on, look at our partners streaming down the bottom of that screen. How many total <laughs> partners do we have for this? Uh, 18. Seven, seven. I was going to make some comment about more than I have fingers and toes, but I, I haven't lost. No, uh, you, enough toes. You do have that, ten toes. That's a I lot. verified that at the beach. And um, they're all they're all fantastic. Like I, you know, you've heard a lot of commentary about where would we be without Zoom and go to meeting and webcams and uh, all the technology we have during the pandemic. Where would the industry be if you took those eighteen names away? That yeah, kind of hit me cool. the other day of like. Like that is the, that's the fuel that's keeping things moving uh, in yes. the environment that we're in. Are those so big years? shout out. Yeah. Big shout out to all of them. Thank you for partnering with us that, you know, they help us get this set up to where it needs to be and to get the studio, to get the speakers, all that fun stuff. Okay. Final thing I want to review and then we can open up to questions, comments, brilliant statements for those of you watching, or even just light banter between Kevin and I, whatever you guys want. Um, here's the, here's the final thing. And what I get passionate about, I hear this all the time, Mike, I don't know if we have the budget. I don't I need to ask for this. I don't know if they'll pay for this, et cetera, et cetera. When I hear that as the quote unquote objection, I get so excited because there's very easy ways to solve the can I go question and will you pay for it? Number one, here's what I think. I think this is worth it to invest on your own. I think $4.95 is, is a reasonable price and will add to your career and help you make more money and help you even make even if you just do the math on the people in your group if you register early enough to be in a group yeah you're absolutely. making 15 to 20 contacts of people like you for that that price that you know like-minded have the same challenges that alone absolutely that's back. a really good point so I, I i could you could justify spending the money on your own but here's 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 the easiest way to get this done if leadership is hem hon, if you're worried about asking, if they, if you don't think they're going to pay for it, all you do is just send a nice little email like this. And as I always like to say, a video email works better when you can say it with video in your face. It comes across, say, Mr. and Mrs. Owner, Mr. and Mrs. Manager, have you seen this? Oh my gosh, this is the coolest thing ever. I am going to participate in this and I'm going to pay for it on my own because it's such a great value. I'd love it. If you would help me with that, let me know. But if not, I'm going to move forward on my own. What do you think? Send love that it. one off and see what they say. We'll see what they say because most, first of all, it's rare to have an employee take initiative, um, especially in a market where selling is happening automatically right now. No offense yep. to everybody out there. We know it's hard work. <laughs> right. It's a lot of work. Yeah, It's a lot yeah. of work, but it's easy work. The, the work is coming. Um. But just sending that email and asking, most people don't ask or ask the right way. And so then they're worried about hearing no. The worst thing they're going to tell you is no, or we'll pay for half or whatever. But I think you'd be surprised mm -hmm. at their response. What do you think about that, Kevin? I think that's fantastic for sure. All the folks that I've ever had um, work for report to me. If they did that with pretty much anything, I would be like, I love it. And of course, you're not paying for that yourself. I'll, you know, We'll take care of that. Yeah. It's a smoking deal. Uh, I mean, it's one third the cost because for <laughs> us guys here, a little bit of open kimono for everybody. It's one third the cost for us to put it on. That's why right. we charge our sponsors. But there is one no third pool. the cost to partner with us. There's, there's no, no what? There's no pool and there's no cocktail party. Okay. So let me just, okay. That's a good, that's a good objection. So you can fill your bathtub up for the pool. Right. And you can drink whatever you want at home. And not during a breakout you, session, but during the not during a breakout training, session, ahead. and you can wear whatever you want. We <laughs> urge you to dress up from the top up, but wear whatever you want. But we truly are excited about this. We're excited about the presentation. We're excited about the content. Man, we have got some fun stuff to share with you. We've got some new reports um, that we've done. We've done a 
pre-COVID, during COVID, and COVID part two. Yeah. Follow-up survey. Oh my gosh, some pretty <clears throat> cool stuff. COVID the, fatigue, let's call it. COVID fatigue. We we've got some more data to share with you about what's happening in the world of uh, you know website visits, traffic, spending, what what people are spending, what they're not spending on, what's working, what's not. We've got more information on how to right size your online sales team because a lot of builders are struggle busting with this right now and we mm -hmm. have figured out ways to solve it. And we've got some new tools that people are using um, that we want to share with you. So beyond all that, you're going to get the latest and greatest best practices, plus hear from awesome speakers, plus hear from industry experts, actual people in the trenches working, doing this well right now. Oh, I can't wait. I, I just look at it as a lot of things have just come completely out of alignment. You just think about, you know, that image of, of multiple cylinder engine or tires on a car needing to be in alignment is when you have something like, oh my goodness, four times the number of leads looking at a builder today. I mean, there, there are 132 leads a day, Whew. a day. And, and this is not an, a national or even really a super regional, 132 a day. That's going to throw everything out of alignment. And that's why we keep using the hashtag what's next in a lot of the promo material is when things are busy like this, it's easy to have tasks every day to check the box and make sure we get done. But if we're not thinking about how do we realign for today, that also puts us in a great position to leapfrog the competition in 2021 and 2022, no matter what which direction really things go you're going to miss out on an opportunity. And that's what's been fun to me, even though I've put less content out in the public in preparation for this is to have, you know, I still use notebooks. I love, I love paper for brainstorming and noodling. And uh, you just look at all that stuff and you're like, man, I can't wait to give everyone that. At yeah, the event. It's going to be awesome. Yeah. The final thing we'll leave you with is um, man, it's the best opportunity to build the perfect program. Because builders are selling mm -hmm. like they've never sold before. A lot of it, right or wrong, your leadership is looking to the online marketing and sales and go, great job, guys. Like you did it. Like everything's double. And you're just like, okay, can I have can I have a budget for this then? Can we, can we hire half a person? Oh, I don't know about that. <laughs> We're going to help know. you. We want to help you right size your program and, right. and get you the the resources that you need. Now is the time uh, to get the resources that you need and plan for the future. Because listen, as this changes, as uh, you know, the pandemic kind of subsides, which it will happen as the election gets past us, which it will happen. It may take a little bit longer this year to happen, but it will. Um, it'll eventually be over. Um, we'll return back to a new uh, style of normal. But there's some things that are sticking past this whole thing that we have ironed out and worked out and customers have now been exposed to that they're not going to want to change. So we want to talk about what's staying and what's not and how you get the resources for that to continue to grow your program. All right, Kevin, take us out with some final awesome uh, philosophical metaphor that you're so good at. What, what do we got? Well, I just think that to me, I, I, I continue to fall just ever so slightly more in love with Twitter. So if you want some of my more <laughs> hot takes, go over to Twitter. But, but today it just hit me that right now, a lot of people are doing more with more. And that is not my definition, personal definition of success. You know, when someone, uh, I, I remember when I first got to my second builder, Heartland Homes in Pittsburgh, I went to a conference and people were bragging about how much bigger or better things were than last year, but they were spending to get it. And you're like, mm. okay, well, that's interesting, yeah. but doing more with more is, is not my definition of success. And there are opportunities all around us right now to, to, to use the more we have to build more and more efficient systems and processes so that the next time, cause, cause what goes up does come down or at yeah. least uh, resets to some level, you better have the most efficient flywheel out there because your budget will be under attack again eventually. That hasn't yeah. happened in the last three, three, four months, but you've got to justify every action you do as a marketer by what is the return on the investment for the company. And, yeah. and, and, and while it might feel good to get those great results, a good CFO and a good CEO will call you out on doing more with more every time and say, did we actually get better or did we just release the purse strings. 
I think that's a good way to put it. Hey, we are excited to see the entire team um, will be jumping on with you virtually October 6th. Um, it, everybody should be thankful to be in the home building industry mm -hmm. and attached to online sales and marketing because it's the busiest, uh, it's the busiest group of people in the busiest industry in the United States of America. So congratulations. We won the lottery during the pandemic. We hope you're winning the pandemic and we're going to help keep that success going. So be sure to register today. Do not wait, get on the pulse group, um, that you want to get on, get at the right wedding table. <laughs> and we will see you soon. Thanks, Kevin. You bet. We'll see you guys in a few weeks. Absolutely.